Grand Rising, Grand Rising, Grandmother, and Rising, everybody. It's me, your Uncle 79, the Spiritual Savage. It's currently 7.45 a.m. on July 10th, 2024. It's 69 degrees Fahrenheit, and uh, it's cloudy outside today. Um, but let's, 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 um, I'm, I got the sage going, you feel me? Because uh, I'm going to tell y'all why in a minute. Uh, do me a favor, make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, select the all options so that you know all my uploads upload, you feel me? I got to clean these glasses off. Uh, Grand Rising uh, Soul Family, what's up baby, good morning, how you doing? Um, I love you. What's up Soul Family, new subscribers, current subscribers, OGs, what you, Savage Apple Seeds. Ugh. Hell yeah, wife beater energy, I got to wash. <laughs> I'll go get some more t-shirts. I kind of I'm feeling like I'm probably gonna go get some more t-shirts. <laughs> hey, listen. I don't like washing clothes. I don't I don't like well, I don't mind washing them, or nor do I mind drying them. It's the it's the part after folding, putting the, you know. But you know, the washing machine here been broke for a minute, so I gotta go to the laundromat to do that. And y'all already know how I feel about outside sometimes you feel me but anyway uh thank you for thank you thank you any any, any new subscribers current subscribers oh geez i appreciate you spirit guys spirit teams y'all the law y'all y'all the law enforcement oh spirit guys spirit teams y'all the law enforcement so maybe i do or you do got some spirit guides that are in law enforcement that's what i just said so that's what you heard you feel me i don't know take the energy as it resonates but thank you to anybody that's made any type of financial contributions to my channel whether that's through Super Chat, Super Thanks, PayPal, or Cash App, I appreciate you. Definitely do, because ain't nobody got to do a damn thing, you feel me? Uh, but Ancestors, 5D and 3D, thank you very much. I was doing, I had a conversation with the Ancestors this morning. Uh, I'm trying to figure out, so comment in the chat, comment down below, because um, I don't, you know, I don't know everything. Uh, are Ancestors people that you are related to? Or could ancestors just be anybody that loved you that passed on? I do a lot of talking to people that um, loved me but are no longer here. Uh, you know, I guess, you know, sometimes we grow up, you know, is that Nikola Tesla? What is Nikola Tesla doing on Google today? It is. Could be one of y'all ancestors. You know that nigga was an alien anyway. Let's face it. Or he or he had some direct connection to some alien alien life here. I'm just telling you. That's what I heard. Uh, but yeah, I do a lot of talking to people that, you know, love me that passed on. I consider those people my ancestors, whether we're blood related or not. Uh, you know, so that's just food for thought. But comment in the chat, comment down below. You know, I'm, I'm not really all that, uh, you know, I'm not all that educated or knowledgeable about um, doing like altar work or ancestor work. To be honest, I've kind of, you know, I've, uh, you know, and I and, and I really kind of feel like that's that's just the, what you know. If, if I didn't grow up in religion, but there's there has been a, a, a heavy religious influence somewhere in my life because you know there's that it seems to be uh, you know taboo to talk to or to or to or to give offerings to ancestors when when there's this hierarchy of uh, the Most High God and you know all these levels to things. But I really kind of feel like. Um, I mean, I, God doesn't mind if, you know, if people uh, give offerings to, uh, you know, high vibrational. Who am I to say? Who am I? To, let me just say this. Who am I? All I know is that I don't think that God minds if people give offerings to ancestors or, or deities. I don't, you know, I don't really feel like God minds that because he made all of them anyways. You know what I'm saying? Like these, 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 uh, you know, deities or gods gods and goddesses the most high god they came from the most high god so those are like his kids right uh, i just i just really kind of feel like the most high god wants us to give him all the praise you feel me like don't forget don't forget don't forget where all y'all came from don't forget these these deities and stuff that you guys are offering making these offerings to whether that's on a high vibration or a low vibration but more specifically what i just heard okay this is a message for the people that are making these these uh, these offerings and these sacrifices to these lowercase g's uh, trying to, you know, trump the big G. You know what I'm saying? Does that make sense? But I give all my praises to the Most High God. Do what you want to do, okay? Intergalactic beings, Galactic Federation. Hi, how you doing? <laughs> I think that's it. Ascended Masters, Guardian Angels, and Archangels. So, get off my shoe, nigga. 
<laughs> These cats been tearing my sh up. Oh no, they can't be fucking with my 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 shell toe with the gold on it. Ain't no baby. No, 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 Spunky. I let them play with the other ones, the Reeboks. Or, or the Nikes, but these ones, nah, okay? They, they not finna tear these ones up. <laughs> Hell no, G. These cats are tear. I'm but I'm telling you that I didn't know that kittens are so destructive. I just didn't know it. They take. I come out here, there's tarot cards all over the floor, note cards, you know, all over the floor. They got little bite marks in them. Uh, yeah, they, they, yeah, I don't know. Maybe I need to go get them like a little, uh, a little jungle gym or something like that or maybe a, a cage to just lock them up in there at night i don't know i'm not gonna do that uh but so to get on with the uh, five 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 on the clock okay uh protection unexpected changes somebody's last name could be johnson or somebody lives on johnson street that this uh message is going to resonate with i don't know what the down i don't you know what i i would like to start off by saying so the most i got okay Woke me up I got, well, at 3.59. Now, anybody that's on, that, that, that knows about, you know, witching hour, which is usually between 3 and 4 in the morning, depending on your time zone, <laughs> I guess. I'm still trying to figure that out. But I got up at 3.59, and I got up, and I was exhausted. Like, it was uh, exhausted. Uh, I woke up, and I was really, really hot. Um, and I just laid there. I was like, man, I felt out of it. They almost got me almost because I'm telling you what else happened after that now. Okay. Spiritual attacks are real y'all. Uh, I'd like to do a return to sender 10 times for guided with love and light. Uh, Things that were sent to me from sources known and unknown. I like to return that ten times fold, guided with love and light. Things that do not belong to me. Some more to be, some more to be, some more to be, and so it is. With some haste behind it. With a little pow wow, a little molly wop behind it. Because I just did a post or uploaded, I uploaded a video, was it yesterday or the day before that, about how, you know, I think it was yesterday. I don't ever get sick. I woke up this morning. I was sick. Oh, uh, 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 yeah, I was, uh, let's just say that, okay, because I'm a gentleman, there's certain things I will not discuss, okay, but let's just say that I woke up and I was exhausted, I had the bubble guts, <laughs> okay, I was hot, I was, it would felt like maybe a, a little bit of tinge of the flu, okay, uh, and, and what I'm hearing now is that, yeah, they, this is this is this is okay. So let me just say this because I know this is going on. I know it's going on. I can see it. I mean, I'm a seer, you know. And, and just and just and just more up for like just to explain it a little bit more. Uh, I don't people. Pe there are people who actually see. You know what I'm saying? See everything that's going on. I'm not one of those kind of seers. I'm a seer where I get where I can where I get the information. I get the download. Or I pick up on, I'm an energy reader, and, and, and then this is where, based upon my circumstances in life, my situations, even people that I know, the, it plays out for me with all of those elements, even with new ones. But what the most, the way that the Most High God has d done it for me is that, uh, so a lot of times when I, uh, I talked about it the other day, when I get the downloads and I can see people in my head that I know doing certain things, it's not always them, but they carry the energy of the energy that is going on in the collective energy. Does that make sense? So it's just basically kind of like I get the download, I get the energy and then, uh, my, my brain or my eyes or my, my third eye projects it for me. Um, using a cast of characters that of people that I know that act out, you know, it's kind of like a kind of like a play, or like a soap opera. I mean, these are the you know whatever days of our lives. But so somebody sent me some 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 spell work this morning during witching hour uh, to 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 take me out. I don't know, but I'll tell you what the Most High told me, or one of my ancestors said. Yep, that was your last. Because some some people out here feel like they got to get their lick back as it pertains to me. So people are still trying to play this. This little back and forth kind of kind of bullshit with me um, sending you know sending out these these this energy because I'm never what 
You know what I'm saying? But so my ancestors want somebody out there to know you got your lick. Now you about to get your licks. Licks back. You fucking scab. Whoever you are to sending out magic and sh it It's a woman. A woman, a feminine energy or 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 a big old girl. You know what I mean by big old gal, a big old girl, some, some, don't even get me started because I'm trying to be nice this morning, you feel me? But you can have all that back, listen, because it don't take much, it don't take, I'm, I'm an alien. Like, seriously, I got alien DNA. Y'all can, it, people go, somebody can go, well, how you know you got alien DNA? Have you not seen my big ass head? Have you not seen my big ass eyes? Have you not seen my arms? Okay, my hands, my fingers. Have you not seen this brain? It's alien. Duh. It doesn't whatever whatever you 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 humans, okay? You human you 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 humans got going on playing in this spell work. Y'all getting all that back. I'm telling you cuz I was I, I just had a whole conversation about how I don't get sick. But I'm but I'm not sick, okay? I got rid of it. And I sent it back to you with your dumb ass, okay? No dead ass though. I know that's what it was. It was spell work because I got up at 3:59. It was like that's why I got. I just I just made it out of witching hour. But the Most High God woke me up like ah uh -uh, here they come, because I was sleep. I was sleeping very peacefully by the way. I got almost eight hours of sleep last night, and you bitches just couldn't let me have that, could you? You had to wake. You had to wake me up at seven seven hours and 59 minutes. Y'all petty as hell. You couldn't even let me get the full eight. You fucking scabs. Let's see what the, the Drunken Auntie Oracle deck has to offer this morning. I like to ask that all evil eyes go blind and all your heroes and demons go deaf. Let's see. We're going to just pull. Somebody getting some money. Cha-ching. An air sign. Mm, love at first sight as well. Somebody about to get up. Somebody, okay, so that's where the cards ended. What is this? He asked you... Uh, <laughs> somebody stupid as fuck. All right, so let's just... Let's just so there's going to be an air sign, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Doesn't matter if you're male or female. Could be a bunch of y'all motherfuckers out there. Somebody is coming into some money. Cha-ching, moolah, baby. And love at first sight. Okay? That's what I heard. That's what the cards wanted to say anyway. So that's, that's an oracle message. But from the Drunken Auntie Oracle deck. He asked, he asked, ah, he asked you to drive that backpack where? It's a setup, but you already suspected that. Are you just, are you stupid or just that dumb? Okay? Always trust your first thought. Your second thought could be your last. So somebody out there, and you could be a Gemini Libra, confirmation, you could be the Gemini Libra Aquarius, love at first sight, uh, that's uh, that's about to come into some money, or you're a dumbass Gemini Libra Aquarius <laughs> air sign who's love at first sight of money got you doing some really stupid things you know we we take what resonates and leave what does not so if all this applied to you before i read this then take this and leave this but if this and this also resonated with you we need to have a talk pull up a seat <laughs> pull up a chair have a seat because whoever you are you about to do something real stupid for a man or for a woman okay Now, I don't. There's a lot of things that uh, I've I've done over the years. We're gonna use the DC Tarot deck because somebody needs some rescue. Somebody needs to get some superhero energy. <laughs> it's not funny, Dwayne. Yes, it is. Page of Wands, man. At the bottom of the deck, the Page of Wands talks about communication, good news, bad news. So, the, good news, good news, good news. Let's just let's let's operate off of that. All right, or maybe you know what. Maybe you aren't about to do something really stupid, okay? Maybe you're not. Maybe maybe you're going to, I don't know. But let's just see here. Somebody or somebody asked you to do something and you said no or you should say no. Or maybe none of this has anything to do with anything. Maybe this is just a message. I don't know. But we do have the page of wands here at the bottom of the deck. I wonder what this is about. So let's see. What's behind that? The, seven, the eight of swords. Somebody could be getting out of jail. 
Good news. Somebody there, there could be some news of somebody getting out of jail with the Eight of Swords in the reverse, a King of Pentacles in the upright, or some type of mental entrapment. But this kind of looks like jail to me. Or somebody speaking from behind bars, telling you to do something so they can get out of jail. Maybe that's what it is. That's what I heard. Five of Wands is going to be some drama behind it, whatever it is. Let's see. Whew. Man. All right, let's see. Hmm. Uh-uh, because I got to know. I got to know what's going on here. So we got a King of Pentacles to the Eight of Swords to the Page of Wands. Let's just do it like this because I was going to try to grab the full story here. But so there's something There's something about... He asked you... Somebody's trying to get out of jail. I don't know. Or some, or some, or get out of... Some, I heard trap. Okay, because the Eight of Swords can talk about being in a trap, like a mental entrapment. But we're talking... This is physical. We got a king and we got a page out here. Okay. So there's some age. There's an age. There's age. In the way that this looks, it looks like somebody's trying to trade places. You feel me? Somebody could be trying to set you up so that they don't go to jail. This king of pentacles here. Capricorn Virgo Taurus energy. He could also look like this too. I don't know. He could look like that. He could be. He could have a bald head. Um, looks like maybe he uses performance enhancing um, substances or drugs. Okay, it looks very constipated. Could be, but this person is a could be like a business owner or something. You know, when we talk about businesses, somebody to asking you to put something. Now, this is this card. All this card represents is it's a setup. Somebody's trying to set you up, but they're setting you up on your own volition, so that when you do get caught, look, pay attention. When you do get caught, you can't say somebody forced you to do it. Somebody told you or asked you to do something for them. Um, and you're, I, I kind of feel like you're just kind of willy nilly like, yeah, I'll do it for you because I love you. I'll do it for you because I love you. You see how she looks very eager. She holding on to that wand, too. So we could be talking about somebody younger, not underage. I'm not picking up on my a minor, but we're talking about somebody a lot younger than this king of feminine energy. OK, take that energy as a resonance. But somebody definitely is is whipped. Somebody's under the, 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 the dick. Somebody digmatized. OK. I'm not going to be doing any intros this week. Um, I'm just going to upload the videos because it, it takes a, it does take a while. It takes a lot of time to record, then upload the video. No, record, then use the, the video editing, and then download that from that, then upload it. So there's there's a, there's a lot of recording and then an uploading and then downloading and uploading again, and that takes a lot of time. So this week I'll just be for the, finishing out the rest of the week. Until I make some more intros, I'll just be uploading the videos as such, okay? I hope everybody's okay with that. If not, not my problem. I just, just being polite. King of Pentacles. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Two more. This person got him. <laughs> Let me get one more, please. Thank you. The Ten of Swords. We got the King of Pentacles to the Two of Swords in the reverse to the Page of Pentacles to the Ten of Swords. Clarify the Ten of Swords. What's this Ten of Swords, please? Ooh-wee. I know. I, I know. Got the nine of cups came out in the reverse or no the upright it would be the upright so what are we talking about here the three of swords and betrayal i'm telling you there's a lot of betrayal energy here so either so this king of pentacles with the two of swords in the reverse the two of swords talks about um being at a stalemate being stuck okay now it also talks about having on blinders, you know, uh, kind of, or having your guards up, but having on blinders. It can talk about being blind to a situation. Something happened to a page of pentacles, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, female energy. 
okay? Ten of Swords, some type of ending. This is what this person wanted too. This King of Pentacles, it's kind of like this person gets what they want from behind bars, which is weird. So we're talking about somebody that could possibly be, you know, placing, uh, putting hits out on, I don't know, putting hits out on people with the Ten of Swords. It looks like, yeah, that's he got what he wanted. So, so there's a there's a feminine energy that has, that has crossed over. Um, I kind of feel like, and this person behind bars acting like they don't know what happened, but they know what happened. They do. Yeah, they do. Tell us what happened. Well, we already know what happened. So there's some type of betrayal here. So I'm picking up on the fact that this King of Pentacles has a lot of younger feminine energies. Doesn't have to be feminine either. But whoever this person is, in one way, shape, or form, uh, has ha is, has contact with... I'm telling you, this is like King of Pentacles. That's like pimp. pimp. Actually, somebody could be a pimp. I don't know. But this page energy out here... There's a there's either th this could be this person's children. I don't really feel like it. I, I don't really feel like it. Tell us more about this King of Pentacles. Thank you, Holy Spirit. We got the Queen of Pentacles trying to get him out of jail, falling underneath the Eight of Swords. So we got a Queen of Pentacles here that is a King of Pentacles, King and Queen of Pentacles. These are this is a couple. Okay, tell us about this. They're tr trying to get this man out of jail. I'm telling you, they're trying to get somebody out of jail. Um, somebody could be being held right now. Somebody could be under. It could be. Uh, you know, somebody could be in prison right now and they're back there and, and they're and they're snitching or trying to set things up. So this is so this is what I know happens. OK, give me one for the Queen of Pentacles before I go into what happens or what I'm hearing happens. OK, but we all know what happens. We get pe people that are behind bars that want to get out of get, get out of jail, get out eight of swords in the reverse. It's talking page. This person is talking to get out of jail. So this person could be doing a lot of setups here, setting people up you know the leading to the to the big guy but i really kind of feel like this is the big guy or this is this guy's done a lot of things this this them and their wife this couple um have done a lot of things they both could be behind bars but i don't really feel like because she's outside of jail this person is in jail trying to get out of jail by whatever they're saying okay so this queen of this queen of pentacles um is set they're they're setting somebody up to take to take something so somebody could have recently just got arrested okay um and for, for maybe some type of possession of something doesn't even have to be possession but i feel like somebody got arrested for something and they're trying to blame it on someone else so somebody they're, they're going to set somebody up to take the fall so we're talking about a fall guy or a scapegoat energy um that's a page because the page we can't discount the fact that pages are out here so this page energy yeah this does talk about communication pages talk about communication so if we're going to look at it like this so maybe the one person already either met their demise okay or got locked up mm -hmm. okay this person could have died or this person could have gotten locked up because the ten of swords can talk about bars but this is more endings so somebody already got somebody already got taken out this this is and, and this is what this king of pentacles really truly wanted the nine of cups that talks about wish fulfillment he's shooting dice I tell you he's playing he's playing with the big dice yeah, see, I'm telling you. Tell me about this Queen of Pentacles, please. They're both in trouble. This King and Queen of Pentacles are both in trouble. Okay? They're both in trouble. Six of Swords in the reverse. There's a, there's a threat. I just heard that there's a threat that they're not going to be selling off to Karma Waters. He's a kitten. I can't get mad at him. He's a kitten. And he ain't bothering me. But he's a deaf damn sure over there rolling in dice, ain't he? <laughs> Six of swords in the reverse, please. We'll take it. What is this? Strength. I'm telling you, there's some... What's weak? What's weak? What's weak? Because something's very weak here. The Knight of Pentacles... To the page i'm telling you all this page energy out here clarify the page of swords what happened with this page of swords something happened with the page of swords maybe their own child maybe this is one of their children a, a, a male a knight of pentacles yeah the knight of pentacles king of pentacles queen of pentacles then we got the nine of pentacles the knight of pentacles now this person could have 
see, let's see, three of pentacles, ten of pentacles, lost a bunch of money. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they did. This person could also be a Leo. It's like it's like this this it's like their child because we're talking about or from somebody from the same family. But I'm picking up child, King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Page of Swords. This is like their son. Okay. Their son got caught, or or. The page of swords is talking about people. Somebody, somebody, maybe this person's son might might have been underneath under underneath surveillance, been under surveillance. Could have possibly, you know, been followed, been getting robbed, or this could just be that they were teaching their kid to do to do things as well. This is a student of their karmic parents. All they care about is money. So we're talking about somebody who could possibly have some type of dealings with the drugas. Okay, that sounds to me. It sounds like street street kind of energy street pharmacist energy because then this person uh, went into some type of partnership with somebody and they lost a bunch of money mm -hmm. a lot of it really picking up on the energy of somebody really be like behind bars a kingpin or like some type of i don't know hierophant you know what i mean like a leader of some type of i don't like to use certain words but let's just say like this is the leader of a group okay but this is a family a mother a father a mother and a son this father is pissed i'm hearing it this person's very pissed off about whatever the, their son got themselves into. Now, their son could have gotten themselves into this due to some type of friend. I'm hearing somebody that they were... I'm telling you, the Three of Pentacles here, it didn't go as planned. Lost a bunch of money. So, what is this now? Somebody being set up. So, they're about to... I don't get it. Somebody could be being set up for what happened. There's about to be some street justice. I just heard them. The moon. Catwoman. The hermit undercover undercover somebody's an undercover agent here somebody's been speaking to an undercover about their plans behind bars yeah they have let's see clarify yep the magi i cannot make this shit up the magician gemini virgo energy so what is this telling me here underneath the page of wands okay let's see what let's see what they're telling this moon hermit magician Double on the Virgo. The Ace of Seeds telling this person everything. <laughs> ah, they, yeah, about what happened, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. All right, so let's go back to this. He asked you to drive that backpack to where it's a setup. So I feel like somebody's being set up. I feel like somebody's putting up. Now with this here. Yeah. Somebody's trying to get their son out of out of a bit of a, a bit of a pickle. Confirmation. Somebody's trying to get their son out of a bit of a pickle. Uh, this King of Pentacles is in jail. Okay. The Eight of Swords in the reverse, yeah, that, that, just, that talks about this person probably wants to get out of jail. <clears throat> Excuse me. Florida water here. This King of Pentacles' son is in a bit of a pickle. Lost a bunch of money. Uh... This son could have possibly even gotten caught. <clears throat> popped. Some...
There's some undercover activity going on here. Yeah, there is. Spirit says that's the truth. Okay, so I don't know what else I can say about this here. I kind of I'm picking up on the fact though that whoever you are though, this is what it is. The Page of Pentacles. Somebody's asking. Somebody's gonna ask you to do something for them, and it's gonna seem very, you know, like why wouldn't I? It could it could be easily as something. Hey, can you go pick this up? Can you go pick this up from my wife and then take this? Because this is somebody behind bars. This is somebody that you talk to behind bars as well. This is how you're going to know this is you. I'll get some initials out here. But this is somebody that you are speaking to behind bars. I kind of feel like whoever you are, this King of Pentacles, and you have a sexual relationship, especially with that page of way she's holding on to that damn wand. You holding on to that motherfucker for dear life. I'm trying to tell you, you're trying to hold on, but this man got a wife. Okay. He probably tell I'm hearing he tells you things like it's just business. We're just together for the business or we're just together for the kids. Blah, 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 blah. I don't really love her. I want to be with you kind of energy, the pimp energy, like I said. But this their son got caught up with something and lost a bunch of money here. Tell me more about this. And, and I'm telling you now that that there's nothing that this person would love more than to sacrifice you confirmation yeah this person this person wouldn't love this person doesn't care this person is not trying to protect you either this person is going to pretend like they don't know they're pretending with the two of swords here uh, pretending like they don't know what's going on they're going to ask you to go somewhere they're going to ask you that's what the card is saying anyways i mean take what resonates leave what does not uh if you don't buy if you don't want to believe any of this don't Okay, it's not your message. You feel me? Somebody's gonna ask them. Okay, so tell us about the. Tell us about what this person is going to ask this person to do, so we can get some more clarification. Let's get some initials out here, uh, because sometimes people, and I know what it's like. You need to know every. You need to. There's. There's got to be bullet. There's a number of different confirmations a person generally needs before they go. Okay, that's for me. So we're gonna. We're gonna try it. Okay. These motherfuckers done bit into my mambas. Some initials here. Thank you. Thank you. We got three that came out. S. M. K. S. M. K. K. M. S. Oh, there goes the eye. So somebody's name definitely is Michael or Mike Skim. Somebody's been skim. I can't make it up. 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 Mike. Somebody likes Simix. I don't know something about food service. I don't know. Simix is out here. I feel like somebody's in prison. I really do feel like somebody's in prison. Simix, that's food delivery. Um, somebody could work in the kitchen in the prison. I don't know. But the name Mike, Mike's, Mike's. So we could be talking about Mike's, uh, two Mike's, a junior. You know what I'm saying? A kid. In a, yeah, you feel me? Mike and Ike. Somebody could really like to eat those. Somebody likes to eat Mike and Ike's. There's more than one Mike because we got Mike's out here. Or something was Mike's. Okay. Mm hmm. The name Michael is very significant here. The name Eric could also be very significant. <clears throat> tell me about tell me about this what they're gonna ask this person to do, the collective or whatever. Because to me, it sounds like whatever, you know, there's always a moment for somebody to do something different and, and, and wake up. So you could be in karmic energy right now. I could be talking to a karmic. Probably am. Yeah, it's eight, it's eight of wands in the reverse. This is karma. Okay, something very untrustworthy. Okay. Page of swords in the reverse to the ten. Of, I'm telling you to the ten of coins in the reverse. Sacrifice. Somebody's trying to sacrifice. I'm telling you, dude, whoever you are, 
Okay, so the S did fall on the where the uh, Page of Pentacles is, so your name could start with an S. Um, I mean, there's a million S names, so I mean, seven. I don't know. Could be, seven could be your lucky number. You could life path. My life path number could be seven. I don't know. But what I do know is that your ass is about to be set up. And this is going to be, if you do it, it's going to be karma. It's going to be real quick, too, because somebody is talking to an undercover investigator. They're trying to set you up here. Um, and, 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 from, and and they're going to sacrifice you, okay, Paige? I can tell you, there's a lot of Paige energy out here. Somebody need to grow the fuck up. I said what I said. It's going to be a surprise, too. It's going to be unexpected, because I'm telling you, there is an investigator looking into this family. Undercover. I don't want to keep saying, I'm not going to keep saying, listen, because this family is trying to get away with, get away with murder, get away with some type of crime. You're trying to sell off the smooth selling. They're trying to set you up. They're trying, they're trying to get some, they're, they're trying to get their son out of, so, ah! This is frustrating. Because <laughs> it's, it's, it's like, I, there's some urgency behind what I'm, what I'm here to tell you. So let me hurry up and just finish this message and upload it. Do you feel me? I need some fresh air because I got to get, get away, get out of this, all that witchcraft, okay? Had my stomach hurt. And I, I rode over, looked at the cat like, damn, am I pregnant? <laughs> am I pregnant? This hurts. Fucking scab. I mean, I'm never sick, okay? Look at doctor at the bottom of the deck. But I'm trying to tell you, I ain't sick. Sick Diane. I'm not sick. That name Diane could be very significant as well. It Lord in the reverse. Tell me about Lord in the reverse. What else? Let me just say what else. What else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Thank you, Spirit. Sweetheart. Yeah. This is this is you're you are sweet on this person, this Lord. Look at her. She got the letter in her hand. You've been writing this person. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this person is is a lord in the reverse. So this person has no control. This person has lost some type of control. Or this person has a lord over you, lord over sweetheart. And lord is in the reverse. So this is not a good lord. This is you know whatever. However you want to look at. It. We just had that talk earlier in this in this during this upload. But I am gonna have to. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna. Just, I'm just gonna have to do because I don't want to do that. I don't know. I'm gonna do the intro. Maybe. What time is it? Eight twenty three. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, select the all options so that you know all my uploads upload, you feel me? Uh, this person has got you under some type of mind control. They got you digmatized, okay? One more card here. Yeah, falseness. This person is very false. This is it's Whatever this person is telling you, somebody could have a cat. You could have a cat that looks like this, okay? You could like cats. I like cats. But you could have a cat that kind of looks like this. Or maybe this person even bought you a cat I just heard, Okay? But this person, whatever this person is telling you how they feel about you is a lie. They're just, you've just been being used. You've probably done this before. This is misfortune. Okay. You're younger than this person with young woman here. You're just waiting. Yep. Waiting, waiting, waiting for this person to get out of jail. Yep. Young woman. It fell out in the reverse. So you may be an old ass woman. Come time this person gets out of jail. Come time your ass get out of jail. If you do what they about to ask you to do, you feel me? Uh, but this is going to be some type of misfortune. Uh, this thief here. So I'm picking up on the fact that somebody's going to ask you to go get something that doesn't belong to them or deliver something. If there's some type of theft that's been involved. Of. You know what I feel like? Okay, so I was just going to say, so I don't know. So if somebody is undercover, they have to let you, they have to let things play out. They can't stop karma. They, they, it's not their job, okay, literally. It's not their job to stop anybody from doing anything illegal. Everybody has free will. There is somebody undercover that's watching all this shit go down and got some inside scoop on it. I'm telling you now, this person, clarify, give, tell me about this undercover officer. Let's see if we can get a card out here about this undercover officer. You can't say, a doctor in the reverse. This they can't stop you from doing something stupid. They're not your doctor, okay? I don't know, give me one for doctor in the reverse. What does that mean? I, I'm, I'm, I'm really kind of feeling like this person's, I'm telling you, scholar, because this person is watching you. Doctor in the reverse could talk about not bad news. 
Scholar, this person is watching you. <laughs> this person is watching you. Watch these enemies watching you. They, they, it's all about to play out. Whatever's going on here is something very big here. This King of Pentacles is trying to get out of jail. Their son just got caught up with some shit or their daughter. Yeah. This person is just, these, all, these people, listen, 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 listen. We got enemy cheerfulness in prison. What does that mean here? Somebody's behind, I'm telling you, pretending to be your friend. This person is behind bars, is an enemy. He's an enemy, okay? You see how this person is just waiting behind bars? The enemy, this person is your enemy. This person is not your friend. That's the way I'm looking at it. This undercover officer here, what I'm hearing, maybe this is the reason why you're getting this message i'm gonna get some black card energy out here and then i'm gonna get out this energy here but this message has to go out okay it's kind of like this undercover officer's watching somebody do something and they're like i i they why are they gonna do that i can't stop them from doing that maybe they'll see that they're being set up that they that they're gonna go down with this family all because all because you just decided to take to go pick up something and take it somewhere you're like a mule you're being set up OK, this undercover officer can't stop you. They see it. They see where this is going, especially with doctor and scholar, both in the reverse. They it's kind of like this office. This this undercover officer is like this bitch stupid as hell. I can't stop her. But she whatever. He's here to do a job and I am here, too. So let me just see, because this family, this family has gotten away with multiple crimes with justice, the six of swords in a row. Yeah. Third party. You're just the third party. You're just being used. And give me some more energy. This family's gotten away with a number of different things here. Okay, uh, a lot of theft, a lot of misfortune, possibly even a murder. Okay, but you're but you're being sacrificed. That came out. Remember, they're just sacrificing you so that they can get out of jail or get or, or tie up loose ends because this confirmation tie up loose ends. If you get caught with this, there's well, first of all, your ass is dumb anyways. Because I mean, the way that I see that you holding on to that wand, okay, you are going to take the rap. Period. You're willing to do some time for this person already behind bars that's just trying to get out. I don't know how any of this works. I'm not a criminal. You feel me? Um, I do watch a lot of law. I've watched a lot of law and order, and we all know that, that none of that shit works in a courtroom. Trust me, okay? <laughs> it's not like how you see it on TV. But I, I pick up on the fact that it's kind of like you're down for this person. Like, oh, damn, look at that. Can y'all read that? It says drug dealer. I told you. What is this? What is domestic violence? Okay, so you just somebody like put their hands. A lady of the night. I can't make it up. I was about to say sound like some pimp shit going on here. Somebody could have been in the army. I don't know something about an army, or somebody acts like a drill sergeant, or somebody could be giving you orders like a drill sergeant. Okay, but I just told you. I listen. I caught all this shit earlier. It's a pimp energy here, and not a pimp like lady of the night. You could, I don't know. You wait. I don't know what you've done for this man. I like I would challenge you today to think about maybe what you've done for this man and think about how you can start doing something for yourself is what I just heard. The one thing that you can start doing for yourself right now is not doing not do, not to go not to go do what he asked you to do. OK. Because there's an undercover watching. They're going to you're going to get this. It's basically what I'm picking up on is that there's an entire family about to go down for something and 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 and. Something happened with this son. This son is the son could be telling them that you and him, you're just being set up. I feel like whoever this King of Pentacles is got a number of different women around that he can call on to 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 take the fall for some things here. You feel me? So it's just kind of like you're just, yeah, he doesn't love you. Mm -mm. But do you love you? If you love you, then you better pay attention. Okay. And, and 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 when you talk to him and you tell him, I don't, I'm not gonna do that, and he goes, "Bitch, what the fuck? What did I tell you? Who told you? Who told you you couldn't do that? Don't you say Uncle Savage? <laughs> don't you say Uncle Savage, bitch? Let me get another card. Okay, one more. Don't you don't you tell him? Don't you tell him I said shit? Three of Wands. What's the Three of Wands here? Clock. 
Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. One more. 47, 48, 18. Knight of Wands. Ten of Swords. The bottom of the deck. So basically with the Three of Wands here, this is about ship selling in. This is about something being called in. It's kind of like the Queen of Pentacles here. That's you. Or not. This is the wife and the son, the Knight of Wands here. They're waiting. They're waiting. They are, it's a plan. They've planned. They're just waiting for this to happen. With the Three of Wands here, this Queen of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands. They're just waiting on it to happen. This is this, this, is this man's son and wife now i don't know if this son is behind bars could possibly be but i'm telling you this ten of swords is what they're waiting for to happen to you you feel me okay the hangman i can't make it up sacrifice i can't make it up can't make it up whatever happened with this son i'm hearing this happened a while ago not like a long time ago but this i don't know take wherever you are in the timeline but i just heard that whatever happened like because they planned this they plan to have somebody do something to get somebody out of trouble to 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 make it seem like maybe you took some money uh so this could even be like you're not maybe you're not going to get arrested maybe your ass is just going to get whacked you feel me because this son really messed up Mhm. Mm all right let's finish it off with the somebody somebody's oracle cards you feel me? They took their ass to sleep. Oh, give me some alkaline water. Gotta clear, clear all that little witchcraft. I can't believe I woke up. I can't believe somebody sent me some magic like that. Or sent that energy towards me. I'll tell you, that's exactly what it is. Somebody's a Libra or somebody broke a law, but somebody could possibly be a Libra. All right. Um, somebody's a cancer. So we're talking about a Libra, a cancer. They keep coming out in the reverse. So these are some very low vibrational cancers and Libras. OK, let them watch. I just heard somebody's a fucking genius that came out in the reverse. Somebody's stupid as hell. Somebody needs a motherfucking therapy. OK, let's get some more energy out here. I heard put down your daddy issues and start thinking like a woman. Damn. So somebody wants you to know that who this person is not. I don't know. You possibly could even be calling this nigga daddy. Um, but he already got kids and a wife. Okay. So he's not your daddy. You better not be pregnant either. That's what I heard. Let's get some more energy out here. Okay. Somebody's a divine feminine. That's probably your energy here. Somebody's hiding an inheritance. That just means that somebody could be hiding an inheritance. Or these people are thieves. You feel me? Number of different finances. Somebody's about to get bad news from a doctor. This is. Listen. Let's get a couple more out here. The bad news from the doctor again just just con just confirms the fact that there's a bad prognosis in the future if you decide to do what you're doing here. Okay, somebody's just been caught the fuck up. All right, somebody's a Scorpio. That there goes that endings. There goes those endings. This is going to be a bad thing for you if you decide to go do this. So hopefully you get this message and, and you know who you are. Okay, somebody's about to learn a lesson. You about to listen. This could either be your lesson or the other one can be your lesson is what I just heard. Somebody's not who you think they are. Somebody's also a Leo in the reverse. Okay. Um, somebody's just with you for money or sex. I'm telling you, you've been being used home girl or home boy because, you know, it could be I'm just going off of the energy on the cards, but you could be a dude. You know, um, I've had people in the past ask me to do some of the some some things because they thought I was stupid. Right. Now my question be would be to this man, why can't your son do it? Don't you have a son? Don't you got a daughter? Don't can't your wife take that? They could be asking he could be asking you to go run something to his wife. I don't know. I just really kinda of, I'm picking up on the okay, so this is where we're gonna wrap this up. Whoever you are, you could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Somebody could be asking you to do something when it comes to money. Maybe they're telling you you can make a, some a coinage, some cha-ching. And this is somebody that you are in love with, or so you think. You know, I don't know. I, I'm not in your feelings. I'm not in your body. But somebody, either you or you could be an air sign, or he could be an air sign. Somebody could be an air sign. But it's a setup. 
okay? On another note, though, <laughs> before all the rest of this uh, uh, fuckery came in here, there is an air sign, love at first sight, that's about to come into some major coinage. So take that part, okay? If you're an air sign out there and this resonates with you, take that. I'm an air sign. I'm taking this shit. You feel know I me? Mean? But the rest of this don't have to belong to you. Don't make it fit if it's not yours. You feel know I me? Mean? All right, let's get some. Uh, I don't know, cause this is this is stupid. What well, it's not stupid, but it is kind of stupid, okay? Because because you know we, there has been a time period in all of our lives where we've all done something for somebody and we know we shouldn't have done it or we did it with you know and just didn't even think twice about it. I was that kind of person, you know. If a friend of mine asked me, nah, I wasn't oh, okay. I'll do it right away, you know. But I need to know what I'm getting myself into, and I probably got your back kind of energy. Not no more. You feel me? Uh, that's not happening. You feel me? Especially, you know. You know, there was a time period. I, was, I used to be with somebody for like 11 years, G, on and off. I didn't did anything for anything. You feel me? <laughs> uh, but that was when I was a lot younger, okay? And, 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 and didn't know anything about what real love was about. I'm telling you, that motherfucker could have asked me to. I'm telling you, it would have happened. Okay? So I'm picking up on the fact that whoever this person is, is somebody that you are definitely all about. Let's get some uh, shamanic killing oracle cards out here and then I'm closing out this message and I'm just going to upload it and get on with my day. Looks like it's going to rain. I wasn't expecting rain today. Sexual energy, number 25, abundance, 13, one more, thank you Holy Spirit, burden, <laughs> yeah, yeah, there we go. I, I agree. I agree. Sexual energy and abundance is your burden. That's that, that's. So you got this man who's probably hung like a Clydesdale. OK, because there's a horse there. OK, I'm just saying. You're holding on to that sexual energy. And the money of oh, cha-ching. What are we talking about? Love at first sight. You know, love at first sight. People say they don't believe in it. I definitely do believe in it. Uh, so I know what it feels like anyway. So I feel like this love at first sight energy. Okay. That's, that's that sexual energy right here. And you got the cha-ching. I can't make it up. And it's a setup. All these cards are matching up with the Oracle. It's a burden. You're being set up. Okay. Air sign. Remember Mike, Mike and Ike's or S Simix. I don't know. That's the end of this message. 52, 55 on the clock. I call 838 AM. That's a confirmation. Look up that angel number. Could be very significant for you. Uh, but that's it. I'm going to close out this message um, and figure out if I'm going to go get some more t-shirts and go to the laundromat. <laughs> yeah, but thank you most I got for bringing us here today, man. I appreciate it. All right, so this is the end of this message. I'm closing it out. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, select the all options so that you know when all my uploads are uploaded. You feel me? I'm your Uncle 79, the Spiritual Savage. Remember, you grow, I grow, you grow, we, we grow together. I always love and light around this bitch. As always, take it easy. I love you to the moon and back. Baby, I love you. Deuces.